I think I think Senator Hoven answered your question, but I what I want to do is encourage you to look at this this problem longer term and from thirty five thousand feet. Name two countries who don't give a damn about reducing CO two emissions. Russia and China. Name other people in parts of the world that do care about reducing CO2 emissions. The West, Europe, the United States of America, John Kennedy, I care. The reduction of CO2 emissions is an important policy. So is national security. And what Russia and, 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 and uh, China have done here they have taken advantage of, of the, the effort to reduce CO2 emissions, which to the Biden administration means a frontal assault on oil and gas. It's so clear what's happening. And they're working together. This isn't just about Ukraine. It's about the East China Sea and the South China Sea and Taiwan and Africa. It's so clear. And the president needs to hit this head on. How are we going to win this? How are we going to make Putin a pariah? How are we going to kick him out of the international community, kick him out of the international marketplace if you don't attack his oil and gas? And it's not going away, folks. And, and point two, I need you to, to ask my friend Secretary Yellen a question. We just gave Putin $18 billion in special drawing rights. Secretary Yellen said, oh, we've got to issue these special drawing rights, make the IMF do it, these gift cards. She didn't bother to explain, and why? To help the poor countries buy vaccines. She didn't bother to explain that most of these gift cards, these special drawing rights, are going to the wealthiest countries. The small countries get the little end of nothing. And she just handed Vladimir Putin $18 billion. And we didn't hear a word from her. And we didn't hear a word from the IMF. You couldn't have found them on, with, with a search party. You couldn't have found them with Google. They just turned the money over. I, I, I'd be a little curious about that. I'll talk to you. I'm sorry, Jim. Well, uh, here's what we're going to do. I can talk as long as Cruz, though. I just learned. <laughs>